Welcome to Moving Through and Beyond, a podcast dedicated to sharing inspired journeys of redefining life, vision, and purpose after immense hardship and grief. My goal with this podcast is to give you hope and to let my guest journeys inspire you to make the choice to keep looking up. I'm your host, Carrie Conley. I want to teach you all a little trick, especially at the time of year we're in right now, where a lot of people have already set their goals and their resolutions for the year. And I don't know if you know this, but it's less than 8% of us that set goals that actually achieve them at the end of the year. And there are a lot of reasons for that, but I want to teach you one little trick that I've been teaching to so many people when I get them to write their vision on paper that I think will help you really crush your goals this year. So when you write out your vision of what you want, what you're envisioning the end of this year looking like in every area of your life, right? Think about your family life, your faith life, your friends, your fitness and health, your finances, your career, all of those things get really, really clear on what you envision it looking like between now and the end of the year. And the next thing I want you to become aware of, it's what is the internal dialogue that's going on in your head? Because usually when I get people to write this out in front of me at a workshop, and I start asking them, how do you feel about what you just wrote? I get a lot of positive feedback. I feel hopeful, I'm excited. I can see how I can break this down into bite-sized chunks. But I also get a lot of people saying, I feel a lot of pressure. I feel that I'm already behind the eight ball. I'm overwhelmed because it's so big, especially if you set some really big goals. And I'm already feeling like I'm shutting down and I'm feeling the fear. And I want to give you a little tip. First of all, identify that fear means that you're going in the right direction because you're getting outside of your comfort zone. It's not that you're about to do something wrong. It's probably because you're about to do something really right. And the second thing is when you set a goal in any of those areas, the first thing you have to identify is what is the first thought that you have about that goal because that becomes the real obstacle. And it's going to be impossible to reach the goal if you don't start working on breaking down the obstacle, which is usually what's going on up here. So become aware, my friends, when you are dreaming, when you're goal setting, what's the internal dialogue that you have going on? And go to work on changing that first. If you found this episode inspiring or helpful, please share it with a friend or a family member. In order to be successful on this mission, I can't do it alone. Connect with me at www.carryconley.com. And don't forget to sign up for my weekly Do It On Purpose newsletter. Let's build this life-giving vision movement together to end this epidemic, save lives, and create purpose. Purpose.